These are what I call youngsters because I'm 56. No shame in my game. Um, these youngsters have a different idea of what it means to be a driver. And while they are doing the job, and I'm not saying all of them are like this, while they're doing the job, they're sexualizing a lot of the things. And What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Breaking Truckers. You reached out to a third party who engaged me in the purpose of holding your towers. That third person's word was your word as he represented you. That's right. 30 year veteran asked female truckers to stop sexualizing the trucking industry. No more wasting time. Let's get it. Hold on. Hey, lady truck drivers, come here for a second. Come here for a second. Stop embarrassing the trucking industry. You don't have to prove that you're cute. You don't have to prove that you're all that. All you have to do is do your job and get your money, okay? They're gonna look at you regardless of who you are, what you're wearing. Watch it. Represent this industry well and represent all of us who pray, paid a price for you to be out here. Get it together. That's all, I love you. But well, I'm glad you love all these uh, female truckers out here. But D Silva, yes, sir, the 30 year veteran, the OG, the one that paved the way for these new Jack female truckers out here. She's came out here with this plea for you guys. It's too many, too many, too many of you out here that's doing trucking for all the wrong trucking reasons now whatever reason that you got into it that's not my business i'm not here to compete that if you got into it for uh anything of personal base or or financial base that's good you do you nobody out here has any reason or any business even telling you what to do how to do and when to do you're a grown woman but it is way too many of y'all out here that's putting yourselves in dangerous situations all because you want those views you want those lights you want the vi the virability of of being you know maybe the it trucker the popular trucker the female trucker the less that you have on the tighter that it is you know but some of which which is good you know you want to do a brand or anything of that matter but you're in the industry where females are looked at differently some of them are respected like the sova uh tiffany uh i can't remember her last name uh female drivers like uh like diva uh miss diva trucker female drivers that made way that that opened up the industry for females like sheree moore and the almighty she trucking trucking group you know females of those magnitudes that didn't have to show off their bodies or show off their sexuality to make it in this industry and be respected as they are today new drivers new female drivers that's coming in i get it this is the social media this this is it this is the era of social media everything has to be recorded everything has to be posted i get it and in order for you in order for you to come and 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 have something have some virability you're gonna have to do something that's gonna be a little bit more interesting and that's why sexuality is being way overused by you women now you might want to take this as you know as hate as many of you do because there's a lot of females out here that says hey do what you do 
don't who cares what everybody else this is my body this is me i'm a grown-ass woman i do what i want to do i get it you do that but just remember the dangers that's out here you walking in the parking lot half naked you don't think that you're being watched but you are you are being watched you you out there TikTok dancing uh you know dancing in 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 scantily clad clothes over at the fuel islands you don't think you're being watched but you're being watched but you also putting yourself out there as well because you're opening yourself to interpretations now you might be out there doing the job and you do it well you could probably do it better than most of the people out there that's doing it but what you're being perceived as as just another uh just another female trucker out here that's sexuality that's sexualizing the industry and d Sova is here to just simply say stop that's all when you in the truck show that professionality as a truck driver but when you're out of the truck you can do whatever you want to do